Hey everyone, welcome to FilterGrade. Today we're going over a quick tip on how to unblur videos in Adobe Premiere Pro. But let's start with a disclaimer. If you came here expecting to fix incredibly blurry video, then you might be out of luck. Any unblur effects can only go so far. If your video is too blurry, there may be no way to get the data back. Your out-of-focus video may be unrecoverable. And an in-focus video will always look better than an out-of-focus video that you apply these effects to. It will not make it how you want it to look like. But let's do what we can to fix this blurry video in the case that you can't reshoot or can't use the clip in any way. The first thing you can do is play with the contrast. With the video in your timeline, select it and open the color panel. You want to increase the sliders for exposure and for contrast. This may only have a minimal effect, but in some cases it may have a big impact. In this example, not only is the clip brighter, but it's also a bit crisper in the details thanks to the additional contrast. The next step is to try sharpening. With your video in your timeline, go to the effects panel and search for unsharp mask. Drag this effect onto your footage. You'll see options for amount, radius, and threshold. Adjusting the amount is going to make the biggest difference, so start at zero and increase the value from there. In general, changing the amount to around 100 and the radius to around 10 should generally result in the best outcome, so you can start there and go as you please. As you can see in this example, the blurriness is far from completely gone. The waves are a bit crisper, but the background would still be considered pretty blurry. However, increasing the radius too far, even to 50, starts making the background shapes look really weird, so there's certainly diminishing returns. These are the quickest things you can do to save blurry video. If these two steps don't fix the problem, then you might be out of luck. Unfortunately, these methods really are not magic. If your video is blurry or out of focus, you should either reshoot the clip or come up with a creative way to incorporate this footage into your project. If this video helped you, give it a like and subscribe to FilterGrade, and thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to like and subscribe and leave a comment down below. And if you're looking for professional LUTs, Lightroom desktop and mobile presets, Premiere Pro templates, and more photo and video education, visit FilterGrade.com today.